In this tutorial, you'll learn how to build an inventory item. This demonstration covers motorcycles. The Auction 123 database contains information for many 2004 and newer motorcycles and power sports vehicles. For customs or those not listed in the database, you'll need to supply all information and build the listing from scratch. Let's get started. Begin by locating the Create Listing tab in the left menu. Then, click on Other Vehicles. Now, select the vehicle type. If the bike is a custom build on a mainstream chassis, then select the chassis make. If it's a scratch build, frame up custom, then select Other and type in the custom model name. Now, move on to Required Fields. and continue on to Vehicle Options. When you're finished, click Next. Here, you can enter the VIN number, stock number, mileage, and vehicle condition. When adding pricing, it's not necessary to populate all three fields, but you should at least enter an internet price. Also, notice the in-stock date is automatically entered for you. However, you can click on the calendar and change it to a custom date if you like. When you're finished with this page, click Save for Later. You're now looking at the inventory record or instance of this vehicle. Next, click the tab labeled Edit Item and the inventory editor will appear. Glance over the data sets under each tab and make any necessary changes. The bullet list preview displays an overview of all specifications. If you need to add or change information in the bullet list, click the appropriate category at the left. Then, make your changes in the bullet list editor. Finish up by entering vehicle options if applicable. Then, click Save Vehicle. Moving on, let's add a vehicle description. You can either click the Descriptions tab or click Internet Description above the Descriptions section. Leave the template and title as is, then enter your text in the description box. Follow up with any desired formatting changes Then, click Save All when you're finished. The description that was just saved will appear in the inventory record of the vehicle, as well as the eBay listing, should you choose to list this vehicle on eBay at a later time. Here's an important note. Let's say you'd like to copy some text from a website, for example, vehicle specifications, or perhaps you've pre-typed a description in a word processor, such as Microsoft Word. Be aware that hidden HTML code from either of these sources may cause rendering issues or errors within your listing. To avoid this possibility, first copy the text from your source. Then paste it into a notepad. This process automatically strips out all hidden HTML code. After that, simply highlight and copy the text again, then paste it into the description box. Note that any formatting which previously existed, including colors, bold type, underlining, and so forth, is removed during this process, so you'll need to reapply formatting, if applicable, within the description editor. When you're finished, click Save All. Next, if you'd like to leave the default sales contact assigned to this item, you can skip this step. If you'd like to change the contact assignment, click the contact name below the gallery photo and choose the contact you'd like to assign. Then, click Save Selection. Finally, we'll upload vehicle photos. You will not be required to download or install any software to use the Auction123 image tools when operating in Chrome, Firefox, or Internet Explorer 10 or higher. You can either click the Images tab or the Upload Images button just below the gallery photo. Now, click the Browse button and select the images you'd like to upload from your computer by holding the Control button on your keyboard and left-clicking the mouse to make your selections. 
or hold the control button and press the A key to select all images. Then click the open button. To edit an image, move the mouse pointer over the image. Then click the pencil. Make any desired changes using the image tools. Then click the Save button. To reorder your images, left click and drag to the new location, then release. When you're finished making changes, be sure to click the Save button. The creation of your inventory item is now complete. For a full demonstration on how to work with vehicle images, including how to add text, special graphics, image overlays, and more, please see our video tutorial on how to use the Auction123 image management system. Thanks for watching this Auction123 tutorial, and as always, we appreciate your business.